hi guys and welcome to my channel today i'm just gonna go over a few things um a lot of you already know that i've been on the optivia plan if any of you are my clients basically what we're going over today is the eat wise app this is the app that kind of keeps you on track because if you're on the five in one plan the gist of it is that you're eating every two and a half to three hours so it's important that you stay on schedule with that and you stay on plan so five of those are your fuelings and one of those is your lean and green so basically right now i'm just going into my phone and i'm going to record my screen because first what we're going to do is we're going to search for the eatwise app and you probably see it at the very top and then when i click on that the thing i really love about this is when you come in into the reminder settings you can set your time so at the very top you'll see meals per day so basically what that is is it's t you can set it to say how many meals you're eating a day because there's other plans like four and two three and three but for you you're eating six meals a day right and then what you want to do is you're going to be eating two and a half hours that's what i set mine for because if i go if i eat a little earlier or a little later i know that i'm kind of right on schedule most of the time i let it go off depending on if i have to go prepare it you give yourself just a little extra time because usually you're not eating right when the thing goes off you're not like grabbing something really quickly so if you set it for two and a half hours it keeps you within that three hour mark because you kind of want to eat on schedule now you'll also see that you can set up notifications like i do mine for 20 minutes before depending just sometimes when i'm at work i wanted to kind of let me know like hey you need to prepare you're about to do your fueling depending on if i have like something i need to warm in the microwave or a bar and you can also do a second reminder i don't really do that there's also um, a reminder fre frequency how many times you want it to keep reminding you now the really good thing at the bottom you'll also see silent notification now i'll do that sometimes if i know i'm going to be in meetings all day i'll put it on silent because what I don't want is I don't want it going off when I don't know and a lot of times I'll have um, my airpods in so if it goes off and it's not on the silent alarm it'll go off in my airpods so that's okay as well but you kind of want to set it according to what you want to do um let's see even I think you can start it for when your your notification time when you're waking up it says your start eating time if you want to set it to eat you're supposed to eat within 30 minutes to an hour of waking up that keeps your body like kicking your body into motion so when you're waking up go do whatever you got to do in the bathroom keep it to 30 minutes go eat that bar or eat whatever that shake or whatnot to get your day started okay so let's get into it so right now it's going to be a little weird because it's the end of the day for mine i want to see if i could go back and reset it let me see um Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to set some extra reminders, but it's really late tonight. So let's say you set it for every two and a half hours. If you go in here and you press eat, I'm just going to click on the eat. It automatically switches it to the next two and a half hours that you need to eat. So like my next eating time would be 12.05. It's pretty late here. That's why it's saying that I ate at 9.35. It already pushed it back to two and a half hours. But let's say I decided to go ahead and eat... A little earlier which you normally wouldn't do but let's say I go and tell it that I ate at 9 35 again oh they kicked me out let's say I set it at 9 35 again you would see that it would again set the two and a half or whatever but the whole gist of this is like you literally are just pressing the eat button and then it automatically just sets those two and a half hour times and a good thing that my husband and i will do because he's on the plane as well is if at times you find like you're going throughout your day and you haven't eaten all your fuelings and you're seeing that your last one won't be until 11 50 p.m you can come into the notification settings and knock that down to two hours if you know you're going to be in bed before 11:50 because you need to get all those fuelings in that's what i do if something happens and like i wasn't feeling well um one day this weekend i didn't get up to like 10 
all of my fuelings two and a half hours would have put me eating really late at night so what i did is i just bumped i kept it to two and a half hours and then when i realized my last fueling would be really late i kind of cut that to two hours to just notify me every two hours that i should be eating something but for the most part uh that's the eat wise app and um if you guys have any questions i'm sorry i couldn't really do a really good display of it because i'm already past all my eat time so it didn't reset it for me but um for the most part it just gives you an idea and again it's for the activia plan i've been on for four months i'm about to start month five i've lost 47 pounds because i know a lot of you ask um below but if you guys have any questions it's called eat wise it's the little blue app i'll put that up on the screen you can look for it you can set your timers for every two and a half hours when you're eating just press eat and it'll reset the timing for you try it let me know what you think if you have any questions put them down below bye guys